Hey Tubies, it's Psychic Bob. Well, look where I am. I'm right outside the Masonic Temple. But we're not going to the Masonic Temple today. We're here at the Alexandria train station. Psychic Bob's going on a train. Surprise, surprise. I got my bags packed here. I got my Christian Dior bag packed. Psychic Bob ready to be traveling in style. And I'm going to bring you guys along on the adventure today. So come on along. Our sky today is a little overcast. It's a cooler breeze blowing. Even though it's hot, it's the air current is cool. I think we're going to probably have some rain come in later today. But I don't know if I'll see it because I'm traveling. Maybe the area I'm going to won't be raining. We'll find out. But I love this old train station. You can see the old architecture here. It's really something cool, you know. They got this old, uh, the lower part under the tracks. It's all made of stone. They have a little tunnel that goes so you can cross the track safely. You go down the stairs and to the right there, there's a little doorway. You can see it, but so it goes under the tracks. Then you come up on the other side over there. But uh, yeah, we're here waiting for the train. See if anything's coming. We'll take a look up. Our train will be approaching from that way. That way goes to Washington, D.C. And we're going to be going southbound. Because I'm going to go see. Who else am I going to go see in the south? Mom. You guys have been asking about Mom. So we're going to go see her. So I'm just glad you're with us. I know some of you have written to me and said, Say goodbye, Bob. I hate traveling. It makes me stressed out. Well, if you want to have a stress free travel experience you got to plan for it and that means packing things that make the trip fun so you'll notice here i got my christian dior bag and let's see what Sega bob has down in here for this trip well one of the things you got to have is water oh i got me a nice cold water there check that out that good now water is always good when you travel keeps you keeps you refreshed and hydrated you know and you know Nothing like having a little snack, too. So, I also got my little Cheez-It snacks here. So, I got my little snacks there. And I tell you, having a little snack makes the trip more fun, you know. There you go. See? <laughs> now, one of the other things you want to have when you travel is some fun reading material. So, what else I got in my bag here? Oh, look. Here's a magical book I'm reading. Dime Store Magic. This is really cool. It's about a coven of witches that are protecting a witch from an evil group of sorcerers that are a mafia cabal of sorcerers. Pretty cool. Dime Store Magic. Written by Kelly Armstrong. So that's a fun book. You know, something interesting and intriguing. Well, you know me. I'm always studying on my Wiccan stuff. So here's my other book I'm working on, Witchcraft for Tomorrow by Doreen Valiente. Another wonderful book. So you see, we got our snacks, we got our books. You see, traveling can be fun. Make the best of it. Have a good time. Now, to make your travel more enjoyable, a lot of you have been writing and saying, Psyche Bob, I have so much anxiety about traveling. Well, why don't you empower yourself and do a little magic? Today we're going to talk about a magic charm for traveling. Today I'm wearing here a special magical charm from Thailand. This is called a Takrut. I'll show it to you here. The charm that I'm wearing today is called a Takrut. It comes from Thailand. And what they do is the monks in Thailand take some of the uh, sacred scriptures of the Buddha and then they put them on sheets of gold and they roll them into scrolls and they bless them and give them to people. So. This is a sheet that has some sacred scriptures on it. They can have a lot of things. Sometimes they have uh, pictures of the Buddha, uh, sacred geometry, uh, sayings of the Buddha. But they're done on sheets of gold, sometimes silver too. I've seen them silver or gold. This one happens to be gold. And they put them inside a glass tube and then they're sealed. And uh, so today I'm wearing this wonderful charm from Thailand, which I actually ordered from a store in Thailand called a takrut and uh, it's got sacred um, sacred power in it. Um, usually when you buy a takrut they give you a little sheet of paper that shows what's on the scroll. You're not supposed to open it up but it has a copy on paper of what's on the gold 
and I can't find my original copy to show you today, but it has some magical symbols on the This scroll has magical symbols and some wording from the, the Buddhist teaching. So, and it was made by a monk in Thailand at a temple, and it's blessed. So I'm carrying my little magical Buddhist scroll Takru charm with me today. And you know, if you're one of these people who travel and you get nervous, wear something special, something sacred to remind you that you're not alone, that higher power always guides and protects you. Oh, Tubi's a hair train, but this is not my train. This is an Amtrak train coming in. Look at that. going up in New York, I think, or D.C. I think I'm waiting for the BRE, Virginia Rail Express. Ooh, somebody needs some oil on their wheels or brakes or something. It's almost time for our train to arrive, and I'm just waiting and excited. I love going on trains. It's so much fun, and I'm glad you guys are along for the adventure. Alright, here comes our train. Look out, yay, there it is, BRE, way! Alright, we're going to jump on and travel and have fun. Look out. All right, TVs, I'm on the train. We're getting ready to go. Ooh, I'm looking out the window. This is so cool. I love it. There's the stairway. This train has two floors. One goes upstairs. You can see it. We're not going to go up there right now, but maybe we'll go up there later. There's the main door that goes up to the other cars. I'm on the last car. Usually I go to the front in the first car, but today I want to do something different. So I'm on the last car, try something different. We're going, we're on the way, we're pulling out. Bye-bye, <laughs> Alexandria, bye-bye. Looks like we're heading into a storm. It's getting warm. I think a storm's blowing. Look at those clouds. Pretty ominous looking. And look into the deep, lush, dark forest. We might see the green man there. That's a cool view. Oh, and look, we're near water. Oh, I didn't get it on camera. Travel fun. Oh guys, I'm learning all sort of cool stuff. I'm sitting up here by the pamphlet rack. I got a lot of cool reading material. I just found out I can use my Smart Trip card to buy VRE Pass. Um, this is the card that I carry when I go on the subway, and I didn't know it was interfaced with VRE. So basically, you can use it, buy your tickets through your phone, and use this card. That is really cool. I'm excited. I'm going to be definitely working on that. And then look, in case, you know, I know we're used to everything being online, in case the power goes out on your phone and you can't get onto a laptop, you have a little printed VRE schedule. Now that's always helpful. That's the train I ride on. There you go. And then, oh, we, we got our look at this. Passenger Courtesy, a commuter guide to friendly travel. I've always had very good experiences on the train. Well, no, wait. One time I had a really bad experience. 
uh, somebody actually kicked my suitcase and attacked me. But that's another story for another day. I'll have to read that a little later. I'll check that out. Oh, and look, the new issue of Virginia Railway Express Magazine. Ride has come out. I read this every time I come on train. This is the new issue. So we got to check that out. It talks about all the latest happenings with the train. And then, oh, lower the cost of step-up tickets. Chrome on the run. Sarah services the dog. They talk about different commuter issues like people are service dogs. BRE class for Marines at Quantico. Oh, that's interesting. We go through Quantico. BRE 101. Facts about BRE for new riders. I want to read all this. We got a lot to read here, but there you go. Look at the water, guys. Doesn't that look great? We're coming up to Quantico, which is a marine town. It's a marine base here. But a whole town operates around. Some more water. It's a quaint little area along here. Here we are coming into Quantico. This is a marine base. Our brave soldiers, sir. There might be some training swamp area there. Yeah, the Marines, they're tough. You know, I've heard it said that they're studying secret UFO technology at this base. I don't know. I just heard it. I don't know if it's true, but it's certainly possible. Rich green, lush forest here. Well, here we are. I think we're about in town. Yeah, there's some of the military base buildings over there. I think like this whole town is like the base. Like everything that you see is on base. And here we are. <coughs> there's the main garden. Tokyo Japanese restaurant. There's a sign of it. Welcome to Quantico. Now at Quantico. See that? That's cool. The town of Quantico. As I said, I'm not sure if the whole town is part of the base. There's a VRE guy in this uniform. Pretty cool. I want to come down here and have dinner. They have really cool restaurants down here. Here's the Quantico Station. There it is. That's where all the Marines hang out. They keep it spotless. In. I like Marines because they keep things ordered, you know. Look at that. There's the base back there. That's kind of cool. It's a nice little town. Ooh, guys, look at these airplanes or helicopters. Check that out. That's cool looking. Oops, can't see them there. This is like an airfield area. That's a big building. Good God, that's a big building. It's on, on, on. Pretty cool stuff. Look at that interesting boat on the water. That's different. Huh. And some more water on the way.
right, two days, we're almost here. I'm so excited, yay! We're coming into the station slowly, little by little. You know, it always seems the last few minutes takes the longest in a trip. And here we are, here's the river, and here's the little town we're coming up on. We're almost here, guys. We're pulling in now, there's the train station. Parking lot, and here we are. So, let's head on out. Here we are guys, we made it to the train station. There's my train. Virginia Railway Express. Ooh, that was a fun trip. I'm so glad you guys got to come along. We had the best time, didn't we? I'm gonna be lazy and take the elevator here. Let's try this. I've never been on the elevator here. Let's see how this works. Let's see if I just don't feel like going down the stairs. So we'll see how this works. There goes the train pulling out. Oh, here's the elevator. Finally, I came. All right, let's jump on. I take the elevator down. Let's see. Oh, we want to go down to ground, I guess. We'll try that. Ooh, this is fun. <laughs> I love elevators. I like airplanes. Gosh, I haven't been on an airplane with you guys. I think we're gonna have to try that as well. Well, come on along. Here we are. Let's see where this opens up. I'm not sure which side of the door is gonna open. This side. Yes. Oh, look at this guy. Right out onto the street. Now, isn't that something? Look at that. How do you like that? Pretty cool. Hey, TVs. It's Psychic Bob. Well, look. I made it here to Mom's. Oh, look who's excited. Little Grizzly. He knows it's dinner time. Hey, Grizzly. You going to say hi to the tubies? Oh, yes. There you are. And what you looking at? What is Mom doing? Mom, what are you doing? You going to say hi to the tubies? Hi. <laughs> I'm fixing Grizzly's dinner. All right, and what's Grizzly getting today? Looks like some good crunchy food. Crunchy with a little bit of chicken. There you go. All right, and Grizzly's down there. Where'd you go, Grizzly? He's hiding now. No, he'll oh, there sleep. he is. <laughs> Cock, Grizz. You gonna talk? You ready for dinner? Cock. Yeah, he's ready. Hey, speak. Yeah, you know what you want. Talk, talk, talk to mama. Talk, 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 talk. Yeah, you, yeah, you. Yeah. 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 <laughs> well guys we're gonna get him fed i just want you to know i'm here safe and sound keep it here at spirit channel thanks for coming along on the adventure and make sure to help me out like this video favorite it thumbs up share it with your friends and hit subscribe if you haven't done so be part of our senior and hit the bell for notifications and updates you guys are best i love you we'll be back here tomorrow what's tomorrow friday Maybe we'll go out for a UFO walk. Anyways, be here. We'll have an adventure. I'll see you tomorrow. Till then, may all of you always blessed be.